Max Defense received information from its sources that the Philippine Air Force will be rolling the first phase of their ground-based air defense system GBADS, project earlier than scheduled, with the medium-range air defense MRAD, component coming in first, with an approximate ABC of around PHP 7 billion for two batteries, while the short-range air defense SHORID, component will be coming in afterwards. While preference is given on Rafael's Spider Mr. ABS system, other competitors are pushing their products hard, including Beal Defense's Iris TSLM and LIGNEX One's KM Samchi Olmi 2, while a review for Russia's 9K37M1 to 2 buck system could also be considered. India also offered their Akash missile system, while an exiting offer for refurbished Hawk missile system is also in dot place. The new plan based on press. Dudert's policy changes under the development of a strategic deterrent capability includes the acquisition of a singular ground-based air defense missile capability. Previously Max Defense posted on the Philippine Air Force's ground-based air defense system GBADS, project, focusing on the medium-range air defense MRAD, component. But aside from that, the project also has a short-range air defense short, component, which will be acquired separately but simultaneously. Among those being considered are Thales Force Shield System using the Thales Starstreak missile and Rapid Ranger mount, IMEs Red Sky 2, using either the latest version of Poland's Grom or Russia's Igla S missile system, MBDA's system revolving around the Mistral missile, and a system from LIGNEX-1 derived from the Pegasus KSAM system. The Philippine Army also has its own projects on Shorid and GBADS, but will proceed later than that of the PAFs. The Department of National Defense reiterates recently the need to fast-track the acquisition of ground-based air defense systems GBADS, for the Philippine Air Force, as well as for other air defense requirements from the Philippine Army and Philippine Navy, as part of the Horizon 2 phase of the RAF BMP. This is based on the DND's recent action plans, which determines the urgent projects that needs prioritization of implementation. The PATH has a GBADS acquisition project, the PA has requirements to acquire MANTHAs, while the PN is introducing ship-based surface-to-air missile systems in its new ship acquisitions, like the upcoming new frigate and new corvette acquisition. The Department of Budget and Management DBM, released the first special allocation release order CERO, for the GBADS acquisition project last 06 June 2019. The amount covers PHP 1,027,012,500.00, or exactly 15% of the overall cost of the project. Usually all projects that are G2G with the Israeli government requires an initial 15% down payment, with the rest of the payment spread through multi-year allocation payments. The release of CERO for the deposit only means that the project is now expected to undergo awarding anytime soon, considering that the project is now backed up by appropriate funding. As part of the Philippine Air Force's 72nd founding anniversary celebrations, the commanding general PATH Lieutenant Gen. Rosano Brigas confirmed that the Department of National Defense DND, has already released the notice of award NOAA, for the ground-based air defense system GBADS, acquisition project. No further information was provided by the CGPAF.
Checking with sources, Max Defense received confirmation that the NOAA release was only made a few days ago and was awarded in favor of Israel's Rafael Advanced Systems Limited for the Spider Air Defense System. Max Defense is still trying to find out more details, but it is safe to assume that the value of the project is same as the ABC, which is PHP 6846750000.00.